All right, piping. This we're making American Girl doll number dresses. C. Number C. We're going to try to see if we can make some for Etsy. And it's pattern 1220. We've got some great fabric donated by Bolts from the 1970s. And we're making piping because it calls for piping and we don't happen to have any. So we'll just use this. And if you know what piping is, it's like um, something wrapped around a core, fabric around a core that can be used and sewn into the seams sort of to make things look nicer. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to basically just cut a strip of about maybe an inch and then I'm going to wrap it around this and I'm going to sew it, okay? Or we're going to sew it. So that's how it's going to be. Okay, got strips of fabric. Now we're going to get strips of this to go in the middle. Usually you use something a little more solid, but this is what I have here. We're changing the foot so we can get closer to mm -hmm. the fabric. Uh-huh. So now just um, prep, make sure you know where the needle is going down because it has to go down on either side. So you might have to position the needle to the side. Is it hitting the foot at any point? No, right? Um, no? No. Okay, that's good. Now I'm going to show you how we do the piping and you can film. All right, Talk. so basically what we're trying to do is get something that is a little rounded and see what will happen here this lets us get nice and close to the edge and that's what we were trying to do so here we go it's, uh, do you have a zigzag at all a little bit and then this is this seems to be kind of small right two and a half that's right two and a half Oh, right, and what's happening is your foot isn't exactly um, like a, a zipper foot because it has mm -hmm. this right here. Usually mm -hmm. you... I wonder if this can slide. No, it can't. Okay. It's all right. It works fine. Good enough for me. We might be able to use a different foot on it if we have to, but let's see. Oh, it, it might be the inside. Oh, let's try again. Oh, there we go. Perfect. Reverse. Oh, I broke your needle. started on this side before. Okay. Fine, fine, fine. See, it goes. Okay, so that's one. And then this is what piping looks like. Hold it in the light. And then it gets sewn into the seam, but you'll see how that looks later. Okay, do you want to do one? Yeah. Okay. Okay, show me. Show me how it's done. Whoa, you're a fast mover. Oh my god, my heart stopped. I was like, fingers gone. For sure. <laughs> I look outside. Oh, yeah, let me... Tug, tug. Okay. Oh. Yeah, loosen it up and make sure it can go in and out. Uh, it mm -hmm. might be stuck. 
We switched out the um, sewing machine to a Bernina and now we're using the piping on the bottom. So I will show you what that looks like when it is done. Stunning, what piping can do. Look at that. Wow, I love it. A simple thing like that. And I don't think people use it that much anymore. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Very, I very always pretty. wondered what this part of the dress was, was called. Now I know. Well, it's not on every dress, right? Yeah. yeah. But I always kind of liked it. Yeah, so this is the hem. Now, usually what happens is with a hem, you want to finish it nicely, right? Mm -hmm. Because, especially if we're selling a product, but we don't have, we're not going to sell this, so... Mm -hmm. Um, we'll work on figuring out how we might want to finish it so that it's, um, it makes sense. Yeah. But people look at that when they're shopping for stuff. 